Undertaker, won't you please drive slow? Man, this is a beautiful Lord's Day this morning. We got sunshine, nice weather. We've been getting the rain. Anytime I get to hear Kevin lead singing, it's a really good day. Uh, I don't know if y'all, pretty much probably everybody in here has heard that song or that movie, I mean, The Rookie with Kevin Quaid. Dennis Quaid, I'm sorry. And when they was in the locker room, the, when they went to play at the Texas Stadium, the other guy turned to him and said, get, when he was kind of down on himself, he said, guess what we get to do today, old man River? We get to play baseball. Well, we're here today as Christians, and guess what we get to do today? Remember our Savior. That's the reason we're here. All the faults that we have, all the sins that we have, this time we get to remember the reason that we have forgiveness of them. We have a chance of eternal life. But I would ask whenever you uh, take this communion that you will shut out the world. I mean, forget about everything. Just for a few seconds, our Savior deserves your full attention. Don't think about your children, the world, anything. Focus on how much pain and suffering that he went through for us. I mean, it's, it's, you can't hardly fathom. I mean, if you really think about the things that he went through for us, and any time he could have said, I, I can't take it anymore. They're not worth it. But he did that, so let's go to prayer. And Lord, we want to thank you for this day, and we are truly thankful for the things that you give us each day that we, we sometimes forget and we just take for granted that, that we are healthy enough to go to work each day, that we have plenty to eat. And most of all, Lord, that we have hope for eternal life if we will just put you first in our life and always turn to you when we have bad days or we mess up. But most of all, Lord, we're thankful that you were willing to endure this much pain for us, that people that did not deserve it. And I pray now as we take of this bread, which represents your broken body, where you got rocks thrown at it, whipped, hung on the cross, all these things. And also as we take of this fruit of the vine, which represents all the blood that you shed the wars. Lord, we pray that we will allow our minds to go back to that and once again ask you to forgive us for all of our sins. In Christ's name, amen.